Hello everyone. In today's class, we are going to see how to create frame by frame animation in Adobe Photoshop. So let's start. Let's start creating frame by frame animation for any desk logo in Adobe Photoshop. Create the polygon tool and give number of sides four and just give OK. Now let's apply the fill color. Press Ctrl T and increase the size how much you need and press enter. We are going to duplicate the same shape and create an arrow shape. So duplicate it two times. Select the polygon one copy, right click and give rasterize layer because we are going to change the normal shape layer into a normal layer. Now do that same process again to polygon one copy two. Rasterize the layer. Use control and click on the layer. You will get the selection. Select polygon one copy two and press delete. Your selection will be deleted. You will get the arrow shape. Now let's delete polygon one copy. Select the polygon one copy two using control T and this is how the animation will be looking like. Press enter. Select both the shapes and align. Let's select polygon one copy two and move it near the polygon one shape. If your timeline is not visible in the interface, go to windows and select timeline. Here we have two animations. One is frame animation and video timeline. Select frame animation now. Now in the first frame, let's off polygon one and copy two. Select the polygon one shape. Give the first frame zero opacity. Second frame 25. Create third frame and give 50 opacity. Give fourth frame 75 opacity. Give the last frame 100 opacity. If you just play, it will be too fast. So for that, we are going to give an option called motion twin for smooth animation. So let's select first frame and the second frame. Let's select motion twin and give frame to add two. So you will get two frames in between. You can see there second frame is eight, third frame is 17, fourth frame is, fifth frame is 50. So 50 and 75. So fifth and sixth give two frames. You can see there sixth frame is 58, 75. Now eighth and ninth give two frames. You can see there 75, 83 and 92 and 100. So you will get smooth animation now. Let's create 12th frame and on the polygon one copy do the same process. In the 12th frame give 0, in 13th frame give 25, in 14th frame give 50, in 15th frame give 75, in last frame 16th frame give 100. Let's select 12th and 13th. Let's give two frames. Let's select 15 and 16. Let's add two frames. It will be 16 and 17. Now select 18th and 19th frame. Give two frames. Now it will be 19 and 20. Now let's select 21 and 22. Let's add two frames. Let's create 25th frame, select the polygon one copy tool and move it using move tool. Use arrow keys in the keyboard to move. Create the 29th frame and move how much you need. 31 frame, move how much you need. If you create like this, the arrow keys, you won't get perfect animation. Now, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to add a drop shadow effect. Double click the layer, select the 24th frame and double click the layer, you will get layer style option. There select drop shadow effect. Now let me give drop shadow effect. Let's give this value and just give OK. Now if you see here, only 24th frame has this drop shadow effect. 23rd frame doesn't have 
and 22nd frame doesn't have and 25th frame won't have this drop shadow effect so for that what i'm going to do here is let's delete the 25th frame to 34th frame and let's create the animation from the beginning select the 24th frame we got the drop shadow style now let's create a 25th frame and now use move tool and move the frame 26th frame move it a little bit using arrow keys in the keyboard create 27th frame 28th frame and move it until you get the perfect animation let's create the in between frames how we did before so select 24 and 25th frame give motion twin two frames add two frames in between so select 30 and 31 add two frames 33 and 34 add two frames now select 36 and use shift and select the first frame and give 0 0.1 second now let's play you can see that we got the perfect animation now give forever you can see there we got the perfect smooth animation now let's create the text any desk text so for that let's stop this animation create the 37th frame press t in the keyboard and start typing any desk let me give a normal times new roman font for just practice and let's change the color to the red and let's give the size which suits let's give 34 36 if you see here the any desk name is coming all in all the frames but i need only in the 37th frame so for that let's select the 36th frame and you can off the layer or else let's select the 35th frame use shift and select the first frame and you can off to all the layers select the text layer in the 37th frame let's reduce the opacity to zero and let's create 38th frame and let me give 50 percentage opacity in 39th frame let's give 100 percentage opacity now let's select 37 and 38 go to motion twin option let's give now four frames in between so now you can see in 38 it will be 20 40 will be perfect so now four frames if you select the 43rd 44th frame you can see there in between we are getting perfect animation if you just play you will get smooth animation you can see there to stop this go to the last frame select the last frame and let's increase the motion twin by adding four frames if you see there if you see now we will get the perfect animation I hope the video was useful. Thank you.